it's the sun or if it's that I've been getting enough sleep finally. But I woke up today appreciating life so much. Like, it's so funny when you stop and actually think about where you are and what you're doing with your life. And even if it's not everything that you want, you can go, holy crap, I've done a lot. <laughs> like, I, I was looking at those little statues, uh, statues, little figurines that Trevor got me, the Gamora one, and he got himself the Star-Lord one. And I was like, all I've ever wanted was to be in movies and TV shows, and I am finally in it. And it just dawned on me that, um, going back to the Gamora thing, was that like, I love this movie, and I actually met the stunt coordinators who coordinated that movie. It's the same one that coordinated Game of Thrones, and I got to meet them, and these are like my favorite TV shows and movies, and I'm like, I know people who worked on them. This is so cool. Today's just one of those days where like, I just can't believe life. I don't know if I told you guys this too. Sorry, crossing road gets hard when I'm talking about cheesy things. When I was in Belfast, I also met the stunt coordinator for Legend of the Seeker, which that was like a huge show for me because that was kind of like my inspiration to get into stunts. I was watching those fight scenes in it and I was, I was just absolutely obsessed with it. So <laughs> I think that guy was mad I was talking to a camera. But I just can't believe that I'm meeting these people that I've had such, I don't know, excitement for. and. It just doesn't seem real and I just can't believe it and I'm so thankful for everything and you guys because you guys have really helped me along this journey and if I didn't start YouTube, I don't know if I ever would have gotten into stunts. I met somebody through my YouTube that introduced me to some stunt people and I started talking to them and that's kind of how everything sort of started. So thank you you guys for being there for me and encouraging me and making me not lazy when I am lazy. So I just wanted to thank you guys and I hope that wherever you are in life, you can still look at something and be like, I'm proud of that. Oh, good. There's the cheesy talk for the day. I was uh, looking at a script and I dropped it on the ground. So now I have to go through it and reorganize it. <laughs> fail. <laughs> it's only like a couple hundred pages, so it should be fine. <laughs> derp -a derp What are we up to? We're going to get some Japanese barbecue with Josh and his wife, Tam. <gasps> I just remembered the vlogs! And for some reason, when I was talking to you guys, my camera shut off. Um, I just remembered the vlog, and I was sitting here, and I went, <gasps> and Trevor was about to get out, and he's like, what? And I was like, and then I turned it on the camera, and he's like, <laughs> It was funny. Oh, I'm so tired and I don't know why. I think because I had just such a nice relaxing day that my body's like, I just want to sleep forever. <laughs> Walk. Clever title for a coffee shop. Deja Brew. <laughs> I oh love God. it. Close early. Oh yeah. And it's clever because they're like, you go to coffee every day. So it's like Deja Brew. Are we here again? Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> People are so smart. Wanna jaywalk? Let's do it. I mean... You know it's gotta be some kind of a chemical powder. Yeah. It's be a grease fire. What? Right. So it is 9.18 p.m. And we just finished eating the most gigantic food dishes of our lives. It was so yummy though. And I found out that I have a 5 a.m. call time kind of far away, so I have to wake up probably at 3.30 tomorrow. Does that sound, like, right? No snooze. No snoozing. 3.30 p.m. So I can get to work at 5 a.m. Yes. 3.30 a.m. for 5 a.m. That makes sense? Yep. Okay. So I don't know how much vlogging will be done tomorrow. So, Trevor. Do you want to steal my camera tomorrow? <laughs> you just get me pointing at things and going. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. And then I'll and then I'll come home and I'll edit a, or vlog a bit and I'll edit what we have, even if it's nothing. It's, it's okay. 
<laughs> then you have to work the next day. And I'm going to get so much footage and you're going to be like, ah, oh, and then I'm going to say, you said it, you're dead. Like, no. You have the option though. Like I'll, I'll set the camera by your little bed stand and then I'll, I'll say goodbye. I'll cry a little over you and then I'll hug you. Over me? And then, <laughs> what am I waking up all wet? Tears are on your face. And then um, I'll leave and you can do what you want with the camera. You're gonna be wrapped, I'm gonna still be sleeping. You're gonna be like, you're supposed to shoot vlog footage, babe. <laughs> Probably, he sleeps in a lot. <laughs> when I work, I don't get to sleep. So when I'm not working, I'm like, sleep a lot. <laughs> no, it's fine. I do the same. Okay, now I'm gonna go home and edit you and then go to bed. Yay! Okay, everybody, see you tomorrow. I'm gonna play video games so loud. Hey! No, you're not. Awesome thing the day. Today was just really awesome in general. Double ice cream. Oh, yeah. The guy gave me the wrong kind of ice cream, so he brought back the right kind of ice cream and let me have both the ice creams. <laughs> hmm. So much for eating healthy. <laughs> thing of the day hanging out with friends. Oh yeah. Awesome thing of the day is yours hanging out with good friends. Sure. Okay. So we both have an awesome thing of the day, which means you have to have an awesome thing of the day. Put it in the comments below so I know that you're happy or trying to be happy. Okay? Punks? I thought it would be better if I threatened you. Therefore you would possibly type scared in the comments. What am I talking about? I don't know. I'm gonna go to bed soon. Okay, good night. <laughs>